the still of night has been left behind as these warriors wake to face a new day. But when darkness returns, one of these here gathered will have been defeated and cast aside from the quest. Warriors, for now, your place on the company is safe. But though the fear of failure grips you, you must keep up your hopes if you are to succeed. So, who remains determined and who is unsure? It's the start of day four and I'm really excited to know what the challenges are ahead. I'm too behind Melka, but I've got other challenges today, so I'm just going to try my best. Yesterday was a really good day for me because I only lost one life out of the four challenges. I'm currently on five lives and eight rings, which leaves me in last position. I want to try and overtake Harrow. You stand as a test to the trials you have already braved. Many lives have been lost, but do not dwell on these. The day is yet young, so let us embark on today's stage of the quest. Come. To continue on our quest, we must pass safely beneath the ruined walls of this once noble palace. Its occupants fled many ages ago, but the dragon's fire that drove them out still burns fiercely within. To pass safely, you must extinguish the fires. Use this catapult to fire balls of ice at the flames. For every fire you extinguish, you'll receive a gold ring. But be warned, fail to extinguish any or run out of balls of ice and you'll be engulfed by the flames. Rohak, you are still a leader. You will go first. Remember, Rohak, extinguish just one fire and your lives will be preserved. Are you ready? Then, let the challenge begin. single ball of ice remains for you to destroy another fire, Rohak. You did not win another ring, but you have preserved your lives. Melka, Rohak extinguished one fire and won one gold ring. Will you fare better? Are you ready? Then, let the challenge begin. Well done, Melka. Now, can you make it three with your last ice ball? Two rings gained. Well done, Melka. Haro, no one has doused all three flames. Perhaps you will. Are you ready? Then, let the challenge begin.
unfortunate Harold, but you have won gold. Donish, you are in last place, but extinguish just one fire, and you will win back a precious life. Are you ready? Then, let the challenge begin. Through the heat of a contest, you kept cool heads. All of you have earned treasure. Place them on your standards. Tonesh, you have attained nine gold rings and can now win back a life. Now we can pass safely by the battlements. Come. It was quite hard at first, but after you get used to it, it starts to become a bit easier. I was really glad that I managed to get an ice ball through the window, because it meant that I got another life back. I'm glad that I got one ring, so I didn't lose a life, and I'm still in first place. Warriors can achieve much, but by working together, their accomplishments can grow even stronger. But in this next challenge, only by working in pairs, can you hope to reach the gold rings hanging from the forest canopy. By assembling these scattered blocks, you can create a tower. Only then can you safely grasp the rings. Haru, you will build your tower with Rohak. Melka, you will work together with Tonish. Remember, you must balance speed with stability in this challenge. Are you ready? Then, let the challenge begin. Go, 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 go. I'll get him now, you get on. Get back, get back, get back. A single mistake by Haru will cost two warriors' lives. No, no way, no way, no way. Right, remember to stand right in the middle to the balances. Can you reach? Okay, just grab the ring if you can. Please stay. And you've done it. Well done! Tonesh, Melka, you built your tower quickly, but you also built it securely. You were first to reach the rings, and can therefore place them on your standards. Now to your not so fortunate companions. Haro, Rohak, you proceeded with haste when you needed more caution. 
Each of you must now lose a life. And so, another challenge has brought both success and failure. But your fortunes could soon change. Come. managed to do it because I think it was teamwork that made, that helped her along the way. I don't think I was that stable and when I got to top, I stood on the back one and then it just toppled right over. Our journey cannot continue. Our path is blocked by a challenge that requires knowledge above strength and courage. Before you lies the riddle bridge. To cross the bridge, you must answer its riddle, the solution to which is hidden in the path of stones. Answer correctly and gold rings await you, but step on the wrong stones and that will cost you a life. Melka, you are now our leader. You will lead us across the bridge. Rohak, you are in second place, so you will help. Step forward. Rohak, the book before you contains many riddles. Open it and a riddle will be set. But you will have very little time to answer and for Melka to cross the bridge. Delay and the spirits of the bridge will overcome you both. This glass will show you how much time you have left. Are you both ready? Then... Let the challenge begin. I have no bones and no ears. I'm one of many people's fears. When building my home, I get in a spin. It is a trap for my prey to come in. Any ideas? I was going to say ghost or spirit or... I have no bones and no ears. I'm one of many people's fears. When building my home, I get in a spin. It is a trap for my prey to come in. Um, it's all like beetle or something. Shut it one. Yeah, S. 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 Right. I'm going to say you. This riddle has proved difficult, yet every riddle has an answer. Tonesh, Haro, step forward. Remember, use this glass as your guide. Are you both ready? Then, let the challenge begin. I have no bones and no ears. I'm one of many people's fears. When building my home, I get in a spin. It is a trap for my prey to come in. Oh, it's a spider. Yes. Trap is going on. I remember D E. Yeah. Yeah. Has the spider got bones? Um, I'm not sure, but it's our best go. Okay, go ahead. Tonesh, in solving the riddle, you have walked the safe path and also won treasure. Place it on your standards. Now, I must restore your friends. Rohak, Melka, you are brave in your attempt to cross the riddle bridge first, but failing to solve the puzzle demands a heavy toll. Each of you must lose a life. Now, warriors, let us travel on. You have attempted one dangerous crossing, but now we must face another. Come. We had a go and got the right letter the first 
letter right and then picked a second letter and that was wrong, so we lost the life. We went with Spider and that was right, so we both got a gold ring for that. As our road takes us higher, the depths to which you may plunge become greater. This is the high rope, the only way to cross the ravine beneath. You must traverse it if you are to journey onwards. As you make the crossing, there are gold rings to be won, but a life is at stake should you fall from the rope. Tonesh, you have shown a head for heights before. You must lead the way. Tonesh, are you ready? Then, let the challenge begin. The warriors can choose to gather the dangling rings, or leave them behind. It appears that you have decided to ignore the second ring, Rohak. Perhaps it will prove a wise decision.
Your treasure is well earned. Place it on your standard. However, your fellow warriors do not share your good fortune. Tonesh Melka Haro. In taking up this challenge, you risked a great fall. Your gamble did not pay off, and you must pay the price. Now, the sun sinks in the sky, and we have one final challenge to face. For one of you, it will be your last. Come. It would be a lot easier than it actually was. There was one point where I couldn't grab the rope and I just fell forward. Once I had the first ring, I decided not to try for the other two, but I tried to keep going. The first thing that hit me was how wobbly it was because I wasn't expecting it to be like that and I was shaking as well, so that didn't help. make camp tonight, they will do so in the knowledge that another of their comrades has fallen. The architect of their demise, the way of the warrior. Beyond this threshold lie an array of obstacles designed to thwart even the bravest and strongest. Melka, you have only four lives left. Haro, you too have the same number of lives, but you have fewer rings. So it is to you, therefore, that this decisive challenge must fall. Failure here means that you must leave us and return home. But success will ensure your place on the quest. Reach the end of the way of the warrior, and you will find a magical portal. Pass through it, and you will survive to continue on our journey. Haro. There is always hope, even at the threshold of despair. Are you ready? Then may the luck of the raven's eye be with you. Let the challenge begin. Your time on the quest has been cut short, but a wise warrior does not measure their worth in hours. It is your deeds that prove your true worth as a warrior. So be proud of them as you journey homeward. I bid you farewell, friend. I've had a lot of fun. What I remember about Raven is probably like working in a team and like making new friends and things. For our three remaining warriors, their journey continues on a perilous path. Who will tread surely towards their goal of becoming champion? And who will lose their way? All are vulnerable, for even the brightest light can be snuffed out. Come. Next time on Raven, can our warriors find their way across dangerous waters in the battle of the boats? Will they conquer the flaming terror that is Fire Demon? And who will avoid nature's wrath and evade the perils of the blasted mountain?